Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm gonna try something that, you know, I've been kind of afraid to try, but this is like my number one thing. Like, I've always wanted to try this. And that's to restore the clear on carbon fiber. <laughs> So yeah, I've been watching a lot of videos, you know, doing some research and obviously it always looks more easier than it seems on YouTube and stuff, but I'm going to give it a try. As you know, this is my fender that I got uh, professionally repaired, but it still needs to be recleared and we're like two, three weeks away from Honda Day. And this car is definitely going. If you if you're gonna be at Honda Day, either New Jersey or Maryland, you know, we'll be there. But um, we're getting to the point that this I'm either gonna I'm either gonna do it and succeed, or I'm gonna have to um, take it to get recleared. So me and my brother we went out and we bought the Milwaukee sander. You know, spent a little money. And I got the the backing. It, they only had the six inch one in uh, Harbor Freight, so I cut it down to a five. And I have a 400 grit, and I'm gonna go dry with it. So there's nothing more to say but to try and do it. So let's see how it goes. If you didn't know when you're doing paint and stuff or you want something to clean you can use a invisible class cleaner. So this is our test panel and as you can see I mean the smoother one this is 400 with the with the backing. looks pretty good so I think it's safe to you know go ahead with the whole thing all right guys so there you go it's all sanded down this thing made it pretty much light work it does it is heavy you know doing it but you can see it looks pretty good and you know today is not too hot not too cold I think it, there's no wind like if this is my shot to do it this is gonna be the day so let's see let's go for it all right guys what we're using is real 2k clear out of can so what you do this is two part clear coat so once you push that down you're gonna hear the click that means it's activated all right guys so full disclaimer you know i am doing this outside i am doing this you know like i said there's no wind it's like 55 um if, if there was ever a chance for succeeding it would be now and um i've always wanted to do this so let's try it out and um, like the you know, I watch a lot of the videos from paint society His motto is it's only paint If we mess up we can just Sand it and reclear it. So without further ado. Here we go The fan on this thing is huge So it's easy to keep that 50-50 overlap.
guys this is the first coat instant transformation this is crazy it looks amazing I didn't want to sand too far deep so I'm just gonna have to live with these little spider cracks but we're gonna give this uh, 10 minutes to flash and then we're doing the second coat I want to do a total of three coats there you go another 10 minutes pass by and for the third coat all I'm gonna do is a mist mist the whole thing so even though as you can see we don't have no stripes or anything but you know a lot of I've seen a lot of guys say for the last one missed it so that's what we're gonna do hopefully I did the right thing because Seems like we got a little bit of texture there so let's see we might have you know turned a good thing into a bad thing that sucks well let's see let's let it dry matter of fact i'm not even gonna take the risk Yeah, we got our gloss back. I'd rather be safe than sorry. Also, seems like we're getting a little low. But I got the grill out. There should be more than enough of this. So, let's get to it. One thing I wanted to show, this is a new 400, as you can see. And you can still feel it. And this one is the, the old one. And it feels done. So. So don't have a lot of lifetime on it. Yeah, with this thing right here, this was like not even two minutes. I'm gonna shake up our can, make sure we're good. This probably gonna this is probably gonna get done like in two strokes. And there you go. On this one we're getting a little bit more texture but i think it's because you know the carbon fiber was a little bit different but let's let it dry off give it its two more coats getting ready to do the second coat on the grill had to get a little drink because it's nice and warm out we've been seeing the comments that's what we love to see if any comment even negative comment just comment down below let us know what you think so the ones that have been showing love, thank you, we appreciate you. And let's get this second coat on. All right, full disclosure, I did get like these little bubbles. I don't know if they're coming up in camera, but does it look better than it did before? Yeah, 100%, so let's just send it with the last coat. And that's a wrap so let's give these some time to dry this is already dry to the touch you can see in a bit I'm gonna give it an hour to dry 
all right here's the finished product full transparency um we did get like some weird textures i don't know if you can see it or not it looks like a, a weird reaction it's nothing we can do about it um so i don't know if i'm gonna sand that back down or let it rock and over here the fender came out amazing but it can lie to you like after a couple of minutes it feels dry and then i touched it right there and the smudge the so i sprayed it again and then as you saw with the light when i did the light mist it gets like blotchy so i had to re-spray the whole thing again i hope that you know we were it within the time that it's all gonna bond together but uh that's pretty much it let me see you know we do got some some dirt nubs and stuff in there because we are painting outside and over here on the grill you can see like the two contrasts it really sucks that this grill came out like that i thought it was gonna be the easiest but as you know the easiest is all the ones always the ones that bite you in the butt so um it was 80 percent success and that's not bad but you know then again we didn't cheap out we went with the 2k clear we went with a milwaukee sander we got the foam backer and we did a 400 gram to just get the right stuff so you don't run into headaches so yeah guys we got some good results you know doing it quote unquote the half right way um and this this thing did die so we did the fender and the grill so i wouldn't be comfortable doing a hood with anything less than three cans because you don't want to be in the middle of it and and you run out i'd rather have more than less like subscribe thanks a lot